Hey, I wanted to get on here to do this makeup tutorial that everybody's been asking me to do. I never really have time of the morning or during the day to do it when I'm actually putting my makeup on to go somewhere because I'm rushing with kids or whatever. Um, and I really don't do live videos either, so I wanted to do it at night when everybody was in the bed so I could kind of um, learn to work that um, aspect of this. So... Anyway, I just got out of the shower, and I did want to mention the hair products that was sent to me this week by Marissa Turner. Uh, she sent me the Monet hair system to use, and hello, I just got out of the shower and blow dried my hair is all I've done, and it's like poofy and nah, I like my, I'm a fan. Now this stuff's a little bit pricey. I did get on her, get on her site and look around, but. I'm probably going to buy it because I like the way my hair smells and I like the way it feels. And I use this uh, Renew Shampoo and the Intense Repair Conditioner. It's still wet where I had it in the shower. And then when I got out of, uh, oh, and the Split End Mender and this mousse. If you don't get anything, get this mousse. This mousse was pretty amazing. I thought it was. So I will drop Marissa's link in the comments since she was sweet enough to send me all these products to try out and give her a shot because I think she's onto something there with those hair products. But anyway, I've already done my skincare. I use Cinegent skincare. I do. I am a um, distributor for Cinegent's, which is the makers of Lip Sense. So I do use all their skincare. I'm obsessed with it. Uh, and I went ahead and done all that. But as far as my makeup goes, I know I probably should use Cinegent's makeup and I feel terrible that I sell it and I'm not really promoting it on this video but I'm I'm gonna be honest I'm not gonna sit here and tell you something that I do that I don't do just to make a dollar so that's just the way I am but me and my friend were shopping at the mall one day I was out of my make my normal foundation and we went to bare minerals in the mall and that lady suckered us right into buying the um like the starter kit for a hundred dollars and then she gave us like a huge discount and we got tons of makeup and I've been using it and I like it um and it's the bare minerals bare pro liquid foundation I don't know if you can see that this light that I have down here is kind of bright but and I wear sandalwood in it and I did get suckered into buying this big fancy brush that goes with it and I have used it a couple times as you could see but honestly I'm an 80s girl, and back in the day when we put makeup on, we used our fingers, and that's what I'm going to do, because that's how I put it on. So, um, here we go. And I'm going to try to be fast, too, just because. And I don't need any uh, comments on here about, don't rub your face that way or don't do that. You're going to cause wrinkles. I am 40 years old, and I just don't even give a shit about wrinkles at this point in my life. So... It is what it is. I do good to get makeup on. I do good to take a bath. I do good to get ready and even go somewhere. Love to hear you talk. Thank you. I don't realize how hicky I sound until I go back and watch these videos. And I kind of get tickled at myself. But I'm a West Virginia gal. And that's how we sound up in here in L.A. as in Logan County. I wish I was related to you. You're the best. Thank you, Danielle. Girl, you can be my sister. Just come on over to the porch anytime you want. Size curling iron, one inch. I didn't curl it, though. I just, I, I used um, the hair dryer and a, um, a round brush to dry it. But I usually use a one inch curling iron. And I'm missing a lot of these comments. I'll go back and hit them all. Um, my four-year-old son is awake, and he's going to start turning the light off on us. Okay, makeup's rubbed in. There's the foundation. And I do use the mineral veil. Thank you, Christopher. I was feeling a little rough there. I was a little nervous about getting on there without any makeup on, which I have tons of videos without makeup on. You know what? I'm going to miss something here. a live wire <laughs> hello southern ohio hey. i see all kinds of local hi erica there's all kinds of local people on here okay and i also use the bare skin um concealer and this over here i'm not sure what's coming out of my skin or what's going on there um don't think when you get old you ain't gonna have breakouts because that stuff is for real. Hello from Kentucky. I'm not too far from Kentucky. Hi. 
Hi, Carrie. She, my sister-in-law's on there. She's up late on a school night. I don't know what I'm going to do just late at night after I get this makeup on. I might have to go to Walmart or something. Or I'm just going to sleep sitting up in a chair. So tomorrow I can be ready when I open my eyes. Okay, so we're about done with my makeup. As far as that goes. And you know, I, I brought all my makeup downstairs. And I just realized I didn't bring my blush down here. So, oh well. Uh, moving right along. As far as my eyes go, this may be tricky to do with the way I've got this phone set up. I'm kind of using it as my mirror. But... Um, this is a Cinegents product. It's Shadow Sense. It's Onyx. It's actually eyeshadow, but you can use it on your lips. There's all kinds of different ways you can use their Shadow Sense. But I use it for my eyeliner because it's die-hard. And once it dries, it is set kind of like the Lip Sense. I don't know if any of you are familiar with Lip Sense, but once it's on, it's on. But I just kind of take a brush. This is actually a, a Bare Minerals Concealer Brush. And I dab the end of it. I'm going to have to use another mirror to put this on or we're going to be crazy. What powder do I use as bare minerals? And... That's actually how I do my eyeliner. I know that's crazy, and it is kind of tricky, but but once you've been doing it for a while, you get used to it. Hi, Crystal. All these teachers are up so late. Uh, it's Bare Minerals Foundation, the Bare Pro. I don't know if y'all can see that. This light is killer down here. And yes, this is a Too Faced palette. I am a makeup junkie. I have every brand there is. And I get an empty bag every month. That's like worth its weight in gold. Ten bucks and you get all kinds of cool products in it. I know that's kind of getting to be an old fad. Nobody's really doing the empty bag anymore, I don't think. But there's how I do my eyeliner. I'm a teacher too. I should be asleep, but oh well. Yeah, we should all be asleep. My four-year-old's running up and down the steps acting like a crazy man right now. So, and as far as eyeshadow goes in the videos, I'm mostly wearing this Moodstruck Addiction Shadow Palette by Unique number two. As you can see, I like this blissful color. I use it quite a bit. And in this Too Faced palette I use almost every day, I like the Just Peachy. Uh, and candy peach. I use it a bunch, but we're gonna go with Old Faithful over here. And this is a brush that I got in, in my Ipsy bag one month. But I know y'all are disappointed in this because it's nothing, nothing. Um, got eyeshadow on my nose here. It's nothing spectacular. I know y'all was hoping for some big tricks and stuff, but I don't have any. And I'm definitely past the age where you're supposed to be wearing sparkly eyeshadow, but I don't care. I like to sparkle. I'm going to sparkle. When they lay me in my coffin, my sister better be putting some glitzy, glittery eyeshadow on me. One big bright shiny light coming up from that casket. Period. Okay, so that's basically how I do my eyeshadow. And sometimes I go in dark with a little bit darker on the bottom. I feel like I'm disappointing you all in the makeup department because y'all was waiting on something spectacular to go down, but there's not. This is a lot of makeup for 11 o'clock at night. Okay, and there's my eyeshadow. I'm gonna do my mascara. I think it was Pennsylvania 
Hey, Pennsylvania. Never too old for sparkling. Hey, that's what I'm saying. You fancy. You always sparkle. Love you, Miranda. She's one of my lip sense gals. And she works across the road from where I live. And she likes to come over on occasion and get filled in on my crazy life. Where am I from? I am from Chapmanville, West Virginia. It's in Logan County. I'm about an hour south from Charleston. Oh, and this mascara, I've had it for a long time. It comes in my Ipsy bag. It's Smashbox, I think. I do not spend no big crazy amount of time on mascara because I wear fake eyelashes. I just get it on there. I am 40 years old, Sandra. I turned 40 in August. August the 31st. Okay, so we got the mascara on. We'll let that dry. And I forgot to bring my stinking lip sense down here. How could I forget lipstick? But while I'm letting that mascara dry, I always keep makeup wipes with me or baby wipes, whatever. I have a baby, so to wipe my hands and wipe my lips off with. Because if you wear lip scents, I'm going to run upstairs and get my lip scents. I'm going to take you all with me. Uh, but if you wear lip scents, you want to get your lips nice and clean and let them dry really well. Because you want that to have a clean palette to stick on. All right. I kind of wish I would have told everybody my eyelash secret because I went to um, Rite Aid to buy my eyelashes and they were sold out of the kind I always be. I mean, like, they always have eyelashes and there was, like, none there. I was like, what the crap? So, me and Megan went to Walmart last night to get some and they were sold out there, too. I was like, oops, I'm not going to be telling people in my videos anymore what kind of eyelashes. But I went to Rite Aid tonight and they had the kind that I wear. I guess they just stocked them and I bought them all. Uh, I like this kind, too. Um, I get these at um, Ulta. I think Walmart might sell those. But this, these are my go-to. The Kiss um, looks so natural. Flirty is the style. Oh, if I don't get all shaky and do something crazy with these, usually I can slap them. Doddridge County, West Virginia. I, we used to have a cabin there. My dad used to hunt there, so I've been there before. Baby wipes do work for everything. Today, I, happy birthday, Julie. Don't forget your blush. I forgot my blush upstairs. I'm probably just going to use something out of this peach palette here. Here, we're going to improvise because that's that's the way I roll. We'll get some um, eyeshadow and use it for blush. Because I'm not above that. I'm a mom. Her t-shirts are snot rags and her eyeshadow are bl is blush. So, there we go. There we go. Oh, what to do with my lashes? Okay, let me get my lashes back open. Everyone is buying them for Halloween. That, you know what? You're probably right. That is, that is. Hi from Kentucky. Roan County. You're welcome, Donna. Hey, Audrey. What do I do for a living? Well, funny you ask. Um, I was an LPN for 10 years, and then I went back and got my RN. So I've actually been in nursing since 99. But when I got pregnant with my daughter, that's now six. I ended up going off work, um with some complications, and then I just kind of worked per diem after that, and I haven't worked as a nurse in a year. I still have my license, but I actually work from home. I make uh, jewelry now, and this is just something like, we're down here in my workshop, so I have it here, but these are like little badge reels that nurses wear. This is a little turkey. You just clip it on your clothes and put your name tag on it. That's what I do now from home, just for extra money on the side. Um, I'll eventually go back to nursing. My son is deaf, and I stay home with him because he he's a full-time job, and once he gets in school and we get him lined out, I'll go back to nursing eventually, maybe. I'm not a real big fan of nursing. Don't get me wrong. It's just the world today with the drug epidemic makes it hard being a nurse. It's a very stressful job. But I pull my lash off, and um, thank you, Mary Jo. That's a familiar name. I think you worked with my husband or my ex-husband. But I just put a very light line. And when you start doing this, if you're new to fake lashes, you better get you several sets because it's going to be it's going to be an adventure. But I just put a very thin line on my lash. And I use this strip lash adhesive black. Megan is a uh, eyelash 
Guru, and she will not use the black glue, but I started with the black glue. You can buy clear. You can buy glue that changes colors when it's ready, but after I put my glue on there, I just kind of fan them and let it dry until it gets tacky. I hope this is a success every now and again. I, I don't have such success. I'm working on my LPN to RN bridge. Awesome, Sandra. I bet you're a patient's fave. Well, I did talk to my patients a lot. I was one of those nurses that would go in a room and get to yak, and you wouldn't see me for two or three hours of my shift because I'd be in there talking. Joanna, Kyle, do you have a boy? I'm going through a divorce. Um, I'm getting divorced now. I don't have a boyfriend. I got two ex-husbands. <laughs> um, but not a boyfriend. Okay, it should be good and dry. I just take my tweezers, and I lay it on my eye. Oh, my lid. And the glue's got it. Like I said, this is trial and error. Oh, and I hold it there for a few seconds. And I just keep dabbing it down until it stays. That's how I put my fake lashes on. They do eyelash extensions now, which are pretty freaking amazing. But they're kind of costly. So if you're not, you know, if you don't have the money to do it, it's kind of hard to keep up with it. But I love them. I love eyelash extensions. Oh, there we go. Yeah, just got to mess with them. And I got this little handy tool right here. It comes with your eyelashes. I just keep pushing them down till they stay. Oh, and voila, there you go. One eyelash done. Have you tried the magnetic lashes? No, I haven't, but I've wanted to. Have you tried them? I'd be curious how they work. I think you need to buy a couple sets, though, and then it kind of runs into some money. But at least you could reuse them. Do you trim your falsies? Heck no. I just flicky. I just slap them on there. The bigger, the better. I like when the wind blows. It blows my eye open. And actually, we went out on the boat for the 4th of July, and me and my mom both had false eyelashes on. Well, we had our lash, eyelash extensions on then, and it was it was quite a scene. How long do the lashes stay on? Um, a couple, I don't know. I don't really rub my eyes. I've gotten out of the habit of rubbing my eyes or really fooling with my eyes. So I can usually wear a set for a couple days. And then when I take them off, I wash them with my face, whatever face cleaner I use. Or you can use baby shampoo. And I peel the glue off of them with tweezers and reuse them. I have like a cup full of eyelashes on my vanity upstairs. But I wanted a new set to show you all how to put them on. Why am I getting, but, well, because I'm just doing a video. Everybody asks me to do a video on this, and it's the only time I get to do it when the kids are asleep. I'm too crazy during the day. I'm on the go. Run, run, run. Well, put my glue on there. What kind of eyeshadow is that? It is the Moodstruck Addiction Palette Unique. Uh, Blissful, I think, was the color in there. Oh, wait a minute. We're going to let that dry a little bit. I'll... Megan Hodge, love you. Girl, I missed you this evening. Laramie, miss your beautiful face. Got to come see you and catch up. Yes, you do. You're all sexy. Thank you. I, thank you, Sandra Smith, but I don't feel like I'm doing anything special. This is how I get ready every day. Actually, I'm taking longer because I'm chatting. I normally would have been halfway down the road by now. This ain't working because I'm getting, I'm not paying attention. I'm getting glue on my tweezers. I'm using my fingers. Do not do that, Winelda. Go back to these. I got glue on my tweezers. Mm 
This little sucker ain't want to stay down tonight. Here we go. I'm gonna zoom in here so you all can see this. How? Whoa! Anyway, as you can see, you just kind of keep doing that on the top of it until it sticks down really good. Is this where I had my phone? Right up here. Ten dollars for the magnetic lashes. Megan, help SOS. What are you doing, Megan? Okay, and once I get my lashes done, I usually take that brush back and kind of go in and fill in so I don't look crazy. Or I drop my phone. With this perplexed, is, it's dark enough. And that's it. That's how I do my makeup. Uh, but I'm actually going to put some lip scents on so you all can see lips. Oh, oh gosh. I'm going to show you. Sorry. Obviously, I don't do live videos very often. But this Bare Minerals uh, Bare Pro Foundation, you can get it in the powder too. And I did buy it in the powder just because I like to touch up. And I know people say that I'm too old to wear powder because it settles in your creases and stuff, but this crap don't. This is good stuff. If you're old, if you have wrinkles like me, and get you some of this. So when I'm done, I, I put it on there because I just want to seal it all in, and that's the way I do it. I know that's not how they do makeup nowadays. I watch my teen daughter watch tutorials and put makeup on. This is how I learned to put makeup on back in the day. And it always worked, and I always stuck with it. So, while I have you all on here, I'm going to walk upstairs and grab my lip scents so we can do lips and overlook, overlook my basement. This is where all the magic happens down here where I do all my orders and do my work. And I meant to grab this bag before I come down here earlier. I got sidetracked. I was trying to sneak away from Maverick. I'm going to actually open a new tube of lip scents, so... We will get your all's opinion on what color I should wear. Because I like them all. There's not, a, there's not a lip sense color that I've met that I didn't like. Okie dokie. Okay. I do like some lip sense here. We can do Bella. First Love. Bombshell. We're not doing Bombshell because my skin is too dark and it doesn't show up on me. Sheerberry, Plum Pretty. My son Maverick is deaf. Yeah, yes, he is. He's, I mean, he does have some hearing, but he's, he wears hearing aids. Um, and then we have Hazelnut. Hot flash. Oh, Shannon, honey, I know. Sometimes when I get out of the shower, I have got to turn the fan on and lay on the bed naked and, like, cool my body down because I'm like, am I wet or am I sweating? I, I feel you, girl. I feel you. Bella is my bae. Love lip scents. Bella and Praline Rose. Um, do an ombre lip. Vicky, Vicky, honey, I can't do no ombre lip, girl. I cannot do an ombre lip. I don't think so. Sheerberry. Do the darkest color you have. It's fall. Well, let's go with Sheerberry then. I love Sheerberry. Shake it up. And Lip Sense is actually uh, three coats. And you let each coat dry. So this is going to take a few seconds. And you're supposed to do it one sweepy motion. There's coat one. We'll let that dry. Mold wine. I don't have any mold wine, but it is a pretty color. 
Hazelnut is like a dark matte brown. I can show it to you. The other day in my video, I had on a uh, Napa. Everybody was asking. 40s are so much fun. I hope so, girl. I just now got here. I just arrived. <laughs> I'm hoping it gets better. <laughs> it's been pretty good so far. Do I do sign language with your son? I'm not gonna lie, no I don't. No, I do not do sign language with him. We tried that, he's, no, it ain't working. Okay, and I have my pearl gloss down here. Throw some opal gloss on Blackberry. I've done that before, it's pretty, I like it. <laughs> Hi Jessica, I see you laughing. Napa hooked, uh, hooked me. Oh yeah, Erica. Yes, all Cinegents products are amazing. So if you want to try Lip Sense or anything Cinegents, just drop me a private message and I will hook you up. I got stock here. I got several girls that sell under me and they can hook you up or I can place an order and get you what you want. But that is Sheerberry that I have on. I love it. And my makeup's all done. And somebody wanted to see hazelnut. No, oh, I have some hazelnut in here. Here is hazelnut. Can you see that? Let's just open it up. Do you sell lip sense? I do sell lip sense, yes. I'm a Jack All Trades, Master of None. But there's your hazelnut. It's like a, a matte brown. It's a good um, fall color. You can see. Elizabeth, it doesn't feel sticky or weird. Like when you're putting it on, it's, it's dry feeling. But once you put the gloss on and it seals it, um, you have all day wear with it. And it feels fine. The gloss will absorb in. You can reapply the gloss all day long. But it is non-transferable. The color is. And there's the sheer berry that I just put on. So you can see the two different. This light is freaking bright down here. But we'll get a piece of... Well, there's a shipping label. I'll put melt some mortars out. But white paper... Didn't come off. It's good stuff. That's just the gloss, so it works. But anyway, there's my makeup. If you're just now coming in, uh, I have on Bare Minerals Foundation with the powders. And I want it, but it's expensive. Sell it, girl. Sign up to sell it. Um, and that's how I do my makeup. It's nothing special. And I've used these Monet hair products this evening. I feel like a million dollars right now, thanks to Marissa Turner and um, whoever else I've you know, funded when I bought all this stuff. All dressed up and nowhere to go. You look too good to sit at home. Well, I do have my pajamas on. Maybe I'll just go over there and sit on the porch and watch traffic drive by. I don't know. Um, you need to go. Yeah, y'all need to get in the bed. I want new makeup. If you saw, please send me some info. My 16 hours, yes. Now, some of these Lip Sense colors I put on, and I just get like four or five hours wear out of them, which is still amazing for Lip Sense or any kind of lip color. But like this sheer berry will still be on tomorrow. I may get up in the morning and get back on here and let y'all see what it'll look like in the morning. Um, thank you, Kathy. Are you still drinking keto? Yes, I'm still doing the keto drink. Uh, sex pot, hello, Megan Pennington. You need to come see me in my new place. How much is it for the, it's $55 to sign up to sell lip scents. Uh, it's an annual fee, and but you have get a great discount. And we have a lot of uh, promotions uh, starting to come back in um, where we just message me and I'll tell you about it or I can put a link in the um, on my page uh, where you get a discount when you sell it. Uh, it's worth it just to get the discount. Um, Jennifer Massey is sending me a message. She, Jennifer Massey is who I sell lip sense under, and I had a feeling she was going to be uh, rooting me out here, uh, wondering what the crap I'm doing on these videos and not throwing this lip sense around. The matte to me is hard to put on. The matte lip gloss or the matte lipstick? I mean, some colors are um, matte. Um, I'm trying to wipe that off, and it's not going to come off. But um, we do have Oops Remover that we sell. But if you do, if you do want to buy a collection, it's $55 plus tax and shipping. And you're going to get one color, you're going to get a glossy, and you're going to get an Oops. But we have different, um, say you want to get festive, you can do the silver glitter gloss. 
We have pink glitter, we have gold glitter. The matte gloss can also be used as a primer on your face prior to putting your makeup on, which is amazing. <laughs> Megan, stop it. <laughs> okay. How much is Lip Sense? It's uh, $55 plus tax for the collection, which gives you a color, a gloss, and a remover. And if you just want a color, it's um, $25 plus tax. The gloss is $20 plus tax. Thank you. Do you understand? Um, I use all Cinegent skincare. I use all that. Um, and I normally do use the Cinegent foundation. I normally do, but I was out and I didn't order any. Uh, funds have been kind of low with the divorce and everything going on. And I just on a splurge bought that Bare Minerals, which I will, I've actually got some Cinegents. I'm just using that up because I'm a cheapo and I don't want to open up something else. Um, thank you, Randy. I'm trying to read every, I don't have my glasses. I don't know what I've done with them. And I could probably read these comments a little bit better. Um, what eyeliner do you use? I, I don't use an actual eyeliner. What I use is the um, Shadow Sense. It's also by Cinegents. It's $22 plus tax. Um, we have several colors in the eyeshadow. Um, but I just use a brush and I use, I put, you, you can go back in the video and watch, but I just use it. That stuff's pretty die hard too, and it's a big seller at Halloween too. I love bare minerals too. You look thank you. What flavor do you use in keto? I am a chocolate swirl girl. I like the chocolate swirl. I am a big coffee drinker, so over the mornings I take the chocolate swirl, mix it with um, uh, it's just a splash of heavy whipping cream and some instant coffee, and shake it up, and it's kind of like a coffee drink. And then at night I use PB2 in it, kind of make like a Reese shake with it. So. Love your shirt and accent. This is a Walmart. I shop at Walmart. I'm a cheapo. I'm just an everyday person. Trust me. Um, so you sell more than just lip scents. Yeah, Nicole, I, I, I dabble in some keto and some lip scents, and then I do these, the jewelry thing. So I'm just you just never know what I'm going to be on the corner selling next. Uh, love your... Thank you. Man. <laughs> uh, yep, just send me a PM. You can... Um, Message me on the diary site, or uh, you can message me on my, actually on the Winelda Diaries, my messages are all caught up, and I have three girls helping me keep up with messages on that, so you're probably going to get an answer back faster on that, because on my personal uh, Facebook, um, I got 482 messages in there last I checked, and, and I'm, I'm a weeding through, I'm going through them, I'm trying, so just message the diaries page, so I love Walmart Jamie's, I work remotely, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so I am going to flash it. Megan, I swear to God, you're killing me. I can't, I can't deal with you anymore. Okay, I'm getting off here. I'm going to go check on my son. I haven't heard him in a little bit. But thanks for watching. And this weekend, we're going to be doing... I'm going to have a special guest this weekend. I'm going to have... Um, I'm going to have that... Um, the fella that told me that I was uh, beautiful for a heavy girl is going to come on live with me this weekend. And we're going to do a couple challenges. Uh, and you all can give him a hard time. And I may put some lip scents on him. I may do some face mask on him. Uh, but he's definitely going to take... Um, He's going to take some punishment for what he said to me. So he's ready to pay the price. So we'll see you all this weekend. Good night.